Sam, what are we doing here, buddy? We're here at the red carpet world premiere of Freeheld, which is based on the true story of a lesbian couple fighting for their rights. Hey, you, you leaving? Oh, yeah, all kinds of work to do. It's a long drive home. Where's that? Ocean County, New Jersey. <gasps> Damn. You drove all the way out here to play volleyball and you don't even like it? Every now and then I think she'd go out and... Try and meet someone? Yeah. And they don't have girls in Jersey. <laughs> yeah, it's not that. Um, it, people know me back home. It's hard to go out and have privacy. I should go. OK. Can I have your number? Graham? Yeah? What are you looking at? I am looking at a photo of Julianne Moore. <laughs> Wow. Are you excited to see her or I'm something? I'm so excited. She's so beautiful. She's an amazing actress, and I love her in this film. Yeah, what are you going to ask her? I want to ask her how she gets into character. Like, she plays someone who's dying of cancer and fighting for their rights, and she does it so well and so believably. My name is Detective Laurel Hester. I've worked for the Ocean County Police Department for 23 years. Recently, I was diagnosed with stage 4 lung cancer. When my heterosexual colleagues die, their pensions go to their spouses. But because my partner is a woman, I don't get to do that. In my career, I've never asked for special treatment. I'm only asking for equality. Do you know, it was an interesting, I mean, I think we had so many resources with the documentary. Cynthia Wade was so incredibly helpful with transcripts and, and extra footage. And there was, and Stacey Andre was there to tell us what happened, and, and Dane Wells and her family. And I just really, I, I, you know, I read everything I could. I talked to everybody. I watched Laurel in the dock. I, um, you try to get as close to, to a situation as you can. You know, it was honestly an honor to get to play Laurel. I want to tell you about our house. Just really like to hold on to it. To remember how much we love each other. If they say yes, then my tax dollars go to her girlfriend. Yeah, the same way your wife gets your pension if you die. Yeah, but she's my wife. Hell, if you and I got married tomorrow, I'd be entitled to your benefits. Is that a proposal? Oh, my God. We are sticking to a losing position because of some personal beliefs. It's an opportunity to change the world. Thing I care about is justice for the woman that I love.